What's up, gamers and anti-heroes? Today, we're diving headfirst into the anarchic world of Suicide Squad. Kill the Justice League Rocksteady's latest dispatch from the battlefield brings news of changes so big, they might just redefine your endgame grind. Let's break it down. Since its explosive release, Suicide Squad has been a roller coaster of high octane action and, let's be honest, a bit of frustration. Server snags and login lags have been the joker in our deck. But Rocksteady's not just throwing batarangs in the dark, they've got a plan. First up, login and server issues are on the chopping block. Rocksteady's making it their mission to smooth out these hiccups, and that's a relief because nothing's worse than gearing up for a mission only to get snagged on the login screen. But here's where the real game changer comes in. Prometheum, that shiny end game currency we've all been hoarding, it's about to get a major overhaul. Rocksteady's gearing up to adjust the Prometheum game loop, making raising hell missions your go-to for racking up that precious currency. And with rewards increasing with each tier, it's time to strategize squad. Rocksteady's also tuning in to the community's frequency, especially regarding mutators like Boom and Affliction Immunity. They're asking us, the players, for feedback. This is our chance to shape the chaos to our liking. And let's not forget about those underused low-level legendary items balance changes are on the horizon. Staying true to its roots could have made Suicide Squad Rocksteady's crowning achievement. Yet, despite its rocky launch and the backlash, there's a silver lining. With these updates and a commitment to improvement, there's hope for redemption. So what's your take? Are these updates enough to bring you back into the fray? Or is Suicide Squad still on your most wanted list for all the wrong reasons? Drop your thoughts, strategies, and wishlist for future patches in the comments below. If you enjoyed this briefing, give us a like, hit that subscribe button, and join our squad for more gaming news and reviews. Until next time, keep causing chaos, but in the game, please. Personal Opinion The promise of fixing server and login issues is a step in the right direction for Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. However, it's the overhaul of the Prometheum system that catches my eye as a potential game changer. By incentivizing higher tier missions with increasing rewards, Rocksteady could inject new life into the game's end stage, encouraging players to dive back in for more than just a casual playthrough. The focus on community feedback, especially regarding mutators and item balancing, shows a willingness to adapt and evolve based on player experience. While the road to redemption is long, with this update, Suicide Squad might just be on its way to becoming the anti-hero the gaming world didn't know it needed. Here's hoping Rocksteady can deliver on these promises and turn the tide in their favor.